to another vlog with your girl Brooke Kennedy if you're new here welcome go ahead and hit that subscribe button join the Brookie baby gang because the Brookie babies are lit so we have fun and if you subscribe you're gonna have some fun too so happy Sunday you guys it's Sunday March girl I don't never know the daggone date is it March 10th let me see if I'm right mm -hmm. your girl did that it is March 10th it is 2 44 and your girl is about to get out the house Y'all, I have been so lazy all day, but that's okay. That's okay. We don't always have to be on go. We don't always have to be doing something. We can get some rest. We have to rest and recover and relax and do what we got to do and repeat. So, woke up this morning, made me some breakfast, chilled downstairs for just a little bit, talked to my mom, went upstairs, laid in the bed to scroll on my phone, and then ended up taking a nap. So, yeah. And y'all know time went forward, so I'm not really feeling the missed hour of sleep probably will tonight or tomorrow tomorrow once i wake up and get ready for work but y'all know your girl is a summer's baby so i'm excited about the time change it's about to get darker later and i love that it's gonna feel like our days are longer we can get more stuff done that's why i feel okay starting my day a little bit later than normal because yeah so what i'm about to do is i want to go by ulta i just want to look around maybe look at some new makeup products and more so makeup brushes i need some more makeup brushes i could go to target as well that's a good excuse to go to target but i'm gonna go to ulta because i have some gift cards that i need to use and i also want to go by walmart so that might be our first stop because in the last vlog i was talking about the glass meal prep containers i did get on amazon and do some looking but one of you commented and told me to go by walmart and check there as well so i think that's what i'm gonna do i'm also probably going to go by ross or tj maxx because y'all also mentioned that i might can find them in there the only thing with ross and tj maxx is i might not find enough and y'all know I kind of got OCD. I like things a certain way. I'm going to be meal prepping for me, but I'm also going to be meal prepping for Kevin when he gets back. And I just don't want a whole bunch of different meal prep containers. But I also know that they might not be realistic. And as long as they all look kind of similar, it'll be okay. So maybe I won't be so picky. But yeah, and then I'm going to run by the grocery store. That's going to be my last run on the way home probably grab some lunch it'll be a late lunch because there are a couple things that I need and I'm probably going to meal prep tonight I need to do it tonight that way I don't have to worry about doing it tomorrow but either way I'll have all of my stuff here I did take out some chicken so if I don't meal prep tonight I will go ahead and get that seasoned and ready to go for tomorrow but I really want to go to the gym because I really need to get back on my 5 a.m girly routine 5 a.m girly 6 a.m gym girly because i was waking up at 5 really 4 45 but i didn't get out of bed till like 5 15 and then i will be at the gym by 6 so either way we about to get back on it because y'all know that anniversary coming up mm -hmm. that birthday coming up summer coming up and yeah i'm tired of going to the gym for months and then when the summer i mean when the summer is over and the cold season comes around i stop yeah we gotta stop doing that we gotta stop doing that because what type of motivation am i giving you guys none right <sighs> anyways let's go to the car and y'all today i need to order a car mount because i know y'all love the kitchen concerts but y'all should see the concerts that be in the car even though they sound real dangerous maybe y'all shouldn't Girl, let's go. All right, y'all. We just pulled up to Walmart. I ain't even asked y'all earlier. I need to wash my feet. I hope my lace ain't crispy. Looking like one of them. We fall down. Would we get up? <laughs> y'all, I'm in Walmart. <laughs> and I done ran into the twins. The twins won't let me show them, but y'all will meet them soon. 
She don't even want to say. I got the nice twin and the mean twin. We have been talking for a whole freaking hour. And my baby loves Brooke. Yeah, I want y'all to know Brooke is like so sweet in person, so genuine, all that good shit. Like she really <laughs> But yeah, these are the um they got it hell. Twins for the eye. They are y'all twelve dollars for just one. Huh? About the thing about the hell I will. I don't know about all that. She's trying to get me to say that on the vlog, y'all, so she can lock me in. <laughs> nah, you get me. <laughs> because I just wanted them to see what they had. They don't got no rubber made in here. Now, they said it in Walmart. Like, all right, we're going to go down here, you guys, and see what they got. I got to tell y'all about the twins later. They're so much fun. This is all Walmart got. Okay, these are plastic. These are glass, but these are a little too small. Plastic. Mm. This ain't it, y'all. See, I be minding my business, but sometimes I get a little nosy. It was a ha-ha-ha-ha-ha-ha-ha-ha-ha ha, 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 for me. But anyways, y'all, I just pulled up to Ulta. Let's go inside. I got my gift cards, and let's see what they got for your girl. I know for sure I need makeup brushes. I think I told y'all that, but yeah. And y'all, I ran into the twins in Walmart. I love them. They so sweet and funny, but we were sitting there talking for a whole hour. A whole hour. I blame y'all. Y'all put me behind. If I don't meal prep today, it's because of you. Low key, been wanting to try the Summer's Friday CEO Glow Oil. It has vitamin C and turmeric. Okay, so they only have the 1.18 fluid ounce. I want to try the smaller one, so we're probably going to wait on that. Okay, for y'all that always ask about the lip combo, baby, right here. Get you one of these new lips and the MAC chestnut pencil, and you're going to be good to go. Okay, this is where I need to be. So I like these makeup brushes right here by Eco Tools. This is what I want right here. Real techniques. And a new powder brush. I like this contour. Snatch and contour brush. I like that. I'm done with Ulta, y'all. Next spot. All right, y'all. Y'all will be so proud of me. Y'all will be so proud of your girl. I went into Ulta. Didn't buy a whole lot of stuff I didn't need. Then I went by Sephora. Didn't really see anything that I needed. It's only one perfume that I wanted to try. I wore it in Panama. I wore some of my cousins. And y'all, it smells so good. So you know I got to put y'all on. But it's very, very like girly. Like it's a fruity scent. And I don't really go for that because I'm a vanilla girl. But I feel like this fragrance right here is going to be really good for the springtime and summer and vacation. So I wanted to grab it. But y'all also will be proud of me because your girl is at Longhorn, y'all. I'm going on another summer solo date i'm starving i only had breakfast today and i didn't even barely have anything like i didn't have enough so i am at longhorns y'all know i love longhorns it is hot out of these doors see this the problem right here this weather be bipolar jesus christ so, uh, not too much, not too much, not too much. But yeah, so y'all know I'm addicted, I'm hungry, and I was like, let me go ahead and get something to eat because I can't push through. I was gonna try to keep going and go to Ross and then go to the grocery store and then wait till I get home. I was like, nope, let me go ahead and fill my stomach up. I won't worry about Ross today. Or I might, I might, it just depends. It's five o'clock, I'll probably leave here around six if they're not too busy if they're busy i'm not staying so we'll have to see and then i'll go to the grocery store and i may go by ross or i may just go home so i can relax a little bit and then decide if i'm going to meal prep tonight or not so i don't know so let's go in here and see if they're busy i'm gonna try to vlog and not be shy but hell going up in here by myself that's one step vlogging and pulling out a camera for everybody to be staring at me that's a whole nother step somebody was just staring at me <laughs> I'm 
Everybody tell me the answers Me and you isn't the answer Me and you isn't Maybe I'm telling myself that Hey babes, happy Friday. So it's Friday, March 15th. I know y'all, I haven't checked in since, what day was that? Ooh, I can't remember. I know, was that Sunday? Yeah, Sunday, I went out, came back home, and now we're here. Girl, I can't remember, but I just have not been vlogging this week. I had some stuff that I had to take care of. I had some grown folks stuff I had to do. Y'all, I had to get my spreadsheet done for my taxes. I needed to get things planned out and scheduled for this weekend. And today, what have I been doing all week? Because I've been productive and busy, but I just kind of been having other things that I need to do. But yeah, what I've been doing, y'all, is 12.40. On my lunch break, I decided to go ahead and knock out some cleaning because my girls are coming this weekend. We are just going to do a girls' night out. We either may kick it in the house or we may go out. I did reserve a section at one of the lounges here. So yeah, that's what's going to happen. I'm super excited. Um, the little theme is girls' link and drink. Let me show y'all how extra I am because... Matter of fact, I never shared my Cabo itinerary and I think I'm going to put that on TikTok today just to help people out. But y'all, when I say I am so like detailed and I love doing things like that, let me show y'all how I send out just like the invites. Oh, and I'm going to show y'all my nails too. Don't let me forget. I didn't vlog that yesterday because I feel like, you know, I'm going to vlog it sometimes, but sometimes it gets repetitive. Y'all don't see me get my nails done plenty of time. Okay. Let me show y'all how extra I am. It's so cute. Go away. Okay, y'all. So this. And I don't think it has my address on there. Does it have my address? No, it doesn't have my address. So y'all, this is how I send out invitations to my events at my house. I'm just a very organized girl. My friends know that. My mom knows that. My husband knows that. Everybody, like I have my planner. I don't really journal like that, but I do write down a lot of stuff. Um, yeah, when I plan trips, I like to know in advance. If the majority of the group are not itinerary girls, cool. But in my mind, I kind of got a flow of how I like things to go. So yeah, it just says girls Lincoln drinks, talk about a time with margaritas. So we're gonna do tacos. I'm gonna cook tacos and we're gonna have margaritas, lemon drops, and you know, the vibes and whatever happens if we make it to the lounge we make it to the lounge if they get here and they're like no we want to just relax at the house we loving the vibes here then we'll stay here but i'm just i just love to bring everybody together so that's what i'm doing this weekend i'm super excited about that i also booked a flight today y'all another vacation is on the way yes another vacation is on the way i'm so excited i'm so excited i'm just ready to go like ready to go have a good time and travel and yeah, so it's been a good day so far. But what I did on my lunch break is I cleaned the bathroom downstairs. I did the half bathroom down here and I did the guest bathroom. I'm gonna touch up my bathroom tomorrow morning because it's pretty clean, but those were super easy. And that's the thing, y'all. You know, people be always making those little jokes about if your house always clean, you ain't really living in it or it's just not realistic. Yes, it is. It takes a lot of work. That's what they should be saying. Shout out to the people that do it because it takes a lot of work and we all fall short. Y'all know about my closet, okay? Nine times out of 10, I'm gonna say about a seven or eight out of 10. The people house that's always clean, it's one spot in that house they be struggling on. For me right now, it's that beauty room and that day on closet because we have a situation with clothes, shoes, vacation stuff that I've ordered. I don't know what to do with it. Do I sell it? Do I get rid of it? Yeah, those are my problem areas. But main areas, I pretty much pick up after myself on a daily basis. And the guest rooms, they don't get used. One of them holds laundry. I also folded up clothes. And yeah, I didn't have time to hang my clean clothes that needs to be hung. So I just put them in the closet, in my closet. So yeah, the guest rooms are clean. The bathrooms are clean. That was super easy to do. 
y'all hear that thunder and then this evening what i'm gonna do is go ahead and get the groceries that i need for tomorrow's food i'm gonna go ahead and cut up all the vegetables i'm gonna go ahead and clean and season the meat i'm doing chicken tacos shrimp tacos and ground beef so and i'm gonna do a rope tail dip and maybe try to make a homemade guacamole maybe if not girl i'm gonna buy it but and then dress it up you know making my own i may need to go to sam's maybe i'll go to sam's club I don't know. Y'all got a Sam's membership I never use. But maybe I will go there. But I came on camera real quick because I'm about to go hang these pictures in the bathroom. I don't know if y'all remember them. Let me go get them so I can show them to you. But it's the pictures for the half bathroom. I want to go ahead and hang them. Y'all remember these right here that I got back around Vlogmas time? You see what I'm saying? I need to get my shit together. Like, what am I doing? Cause it's not even gonna take that long to hang these pictures, but we gonna hang these pictures today. So that's what we get ready to do. And I'm putting them in this half bathroom and I'm gonna stack them on top of each other instead of sideways. Hopefully that looks good. So I need to check and make sure I got some nails in order to hang them. But yeah, y'all, that's just ridiculous. Like we're in March and you bought those in December. Make it make sense. Finish your freaking house, Brooke. What are you doing? Like, do you not want to make the most of it? Enjoy it while you're here? But anyways, that's what we're gonna go do, y'all. It smells so good in here. Let me tell you something. I love the rain, and I love just hearing the roaring of thunder when I don't have anywhere to go and nothing to do. And right now, I'm in the house, so I need it to be gone by six o'clock. But right now, just the rain and just hearing the rain flowing and the candles, and then it gets all like cozy and dark in your house, it's my favorite like if the weather could be like this on every sunday that i don't have anything to do but be in the house resetting or cuddled up i would love it okay let me shut up rambling let go in here and see what i can do with these pictures i'm gonna try to prop y'all up and yeah let's start these vibes back because i got my friday going and that's another thing too like friday the weather the candles ah! I will wait for, I will wait my time. Here's the nails, you guys. Simple, easy, nice little bust down. So here we go, we're in the bathroom. I know y'all angle is not the best, but y'all slick cricket too, hold on. Okay, y'all still look crooked, but whatever. Okay, so this is what I'm thinking. I'm gonna put one about right here. Y'all see that? I'm going to show y'all from a distance. But there's no other way for me to prop y'all up because this bathroom is not that big. And I'm going to look at my little bedroom back. This, oh, it look real big. Uh-uh. Anyway, so put this one right here. And this one, I'm going to go about right here. I don't want it no lower than right here. And the reason I know, because I've been practicing in here and I put like a little mark right here. So, basically... Probably need to go get me a little. I'm gonna put it about right here. About right here. A little, maybe a tad bit more. About right here. Okay. So I need to go get me a pencil. Okay. I gotta go get a pencil. <laughs> all right y'all so this is how it looks absolutely love the photos over here this right here it just needs some type of warmth in here so i know what i'm gonna do y'all stay tuned i'm gonna keep y'all updated but i know what i need to do over here to add in some warmth who knows we may do it very soon but yeah it's just something is not giving tell me what it is tell me what y'all think it is but i know what it is so as soon as I do that, I feel like it's going to come together. But I just love how clean this look. And I had to fix them, y'all. They were crooked. 
So trust me, they're not crooked right now. It could be the way I'm holding the camera, but I promise you they are straight, they are perfect. I even had a little bit more space in between them. So yeah, I was able to fix them. They look really, really good. And yeah, ought to be shamed for letting them sit this long, but we move. And this candle right here, I know I showed y'all this around Vlogmas, I think, but this cedarwood musk, please get it from Target, smells amazing. All right, y'all, so it is later. I am off work and I'm getting ready to go get some of the groceries. At first, I was gonna put in a online order, y'all, but I need to go get my own groceries because I need to make sure I have everything I have. I can take my time in the store. I can make sure I'm picking good quality groceries. Not saying that the people that shop for you don't, but not all of them. So let me show y'all how I be prepping real quick. Y'all kind of have an idea. Y'all have seen me host plenty of times before. This one is gonna be a little bit more smooth and not so much work, I feel like, because I haven't been running around every day before this day. Like with Friendsmas coming up to Friendsmas, girl, I was doing something every day because I was doing Vlogmas and I was so tired. So I'm pretty much just preparing a taco bar that should be simple i'm not decorating anything all i'm gonna do is have the food set out really nice have the drinks ready the lemon drops the margaritas and yeah i don't think i'm gonna do any decoration i know me though i probably will try to do a little something now i'm not i'm not the home decor is the decoration this time there's nothing else needed i don't want to do all of that i just want them to come to a nice clean home food ready to go laid out all pretty and nice and we just enjoy so yeah let me show you real quick Y'all, so why I thought I was gonna have to go buy like serving trays and stuff, and I'm like, girl, if you don't go through your cabinets and pull out your stuff. So this is my idea. I think I'm gonna put the pico de gallo in there. And then in here, I'm gonna do tomatoes, cheese, onions, or tomatoes, cheese, cilantro. And then same thing, I don't know, or just depends on how much I can get in there, which I feel like I can get a lot. I may do like limes and I don't know, I don't know, but I'm gonna utilize this for like the toppings and stuff. And then over here, I'm gonna do, I said on these I was gonna do half of it with um, the shredded iceberg lettuce and cilantro, just do two of those. And then these right here, I'm probably gonna do like the flower shells on one and maybe like hard shells on the other one. And that's pretty much it. And then I pulled these out because I have 12 of these. I have a number of like 11 people coming this time. It's not a whole lot. It's not as many as Friendsmas. But I feel like a good 10 of us will be here. So that will be perfect. But Lemon Drops is giving French 75 instead of Lemon Drops. But we can still use that for a Lemon Drop. It would be easier. And then I also have in this cabinet, I have these. And I wanna say I have eight of these, plus some that are a little bit different, but they're basically the same thing. So I have a total of like 11 of these. Some of them are in a box put away. I only pull them out when I'm hosting. So I don't know, I may do these. If I do, I'm just gonna stick them in the dishwasher tonight again, just to give them a fresh wash. Like they're clean, but you know, I wanna give them a fresh, fresh refresh. So yeah, that's pretty much everything that I've pulled out so far. Oh. Also, those up there, I pull those down. I use these. And see, I can put the limes in here. And then I could put, I don't know. I don't know, now that I think about it, I could put the limes in here. And I could put the margarita salt for the rims in there. But I usually put the margarita salt in there and I put sugar in here. And I put sugar in here because everybody's dead. Yeah, y'all, that's how your girl do that. So I made my list. I feel like I have everything. House is clean, I just need to get some carpet freshener and then I'm gonna fill up the air wicks either tonight or tomorrow morning. And yeah, so tonight I'm gonna just cut up the vegetables. I told y'all that earlier, so I'm not about to go through that again. And then I need to go by the hair store because I wanna get some ghost bun glue. Cause I think I'm gonna apply this other wig and do a bust down middle part. And I need to get a new flat iron, so. Yeah, we're gonna go to the hair store first, and then I'll meet y'all at the grocery store. All right, y'all, let me explain. Let me explain, because it is 8.49, and I'm back in this kitchen, back in this same spot. So, basically, when I checked in with y'all earlier, I did go by the hair store, and I went to the grocery store. 
I didn't vlog in the hair store because that was real quick. But when I got to the grocery store, I was on the phone with my cousin. Yeah. I was out there talking to her for 45 minutes. And then after that, I went in the grocery store and I was just like, I don't have time to be setting up the camera, trying to hold the camera, trying to get the good angles. I'm sorry, y'all. I had to put me first today. Y'all know I love y'all and I always think about y'all, but I was like, I gotta be in and out because I was ready to go. I'm hungry and I don't want to be up late prepping. I want to be up late doing whatever I want to do. That's how I like to do on Friday and Saturday nights. I like to stay up to 12, 1 o'clock in the morning and watch movies, catch up on vlogs, scroll on my phone, talk to my husband, talk to my friends, do whatever it is I want to do. So I'm going to give you guys a quick grocery haul. Why do I feel like I already did a grocery haul in this video? What's crazy is I don't even know what this vlog is about. I'm going to go ahead and show y'all all the groceries, show y'all the stuff that I got. And then I'm going to start prepping a little bit and yeah. Then I will see you guys tomorrow. So of course I picked up me some Prosecco because I may drink some of this tonight or we'll pop that tomorrow. Um, I was going to get Rosa's lime juice but me and Kevin used to drink this so I'm going to try this out again tomorrow for the margaritas. We got some Mexican cheese, got two bags, we got some chicken breasts. Um, never going to Publix again, okay? Just mind y'all business. I overpaid for these groceries real bad, but I ain't want to fight with Kroger. I ain't want to fight with Walmart. Sorry. Um, got the iceberg lettuce. Four. Why did I get four? Good gracious. I got bacon, some red onions, tomatoes, yellow onions. Um, I needed that for the vacuum. So some freshener, carpet freshener. Got some extra virgin, extra virgin olive oil lemonade for the lemon drops we have some hard taco shells velveta for the rotel we have forks napkins paper plates and some plastic cups we have shrimp for the shrimp tacos we got some beef broth for the ground beef i'm interested to try out this cilantro lime seasoning um got some corn so some people like to put corn on their tacos. Got two cans of Mal Rotel. I think I got two cans. Yeah, right here. And then I got some chili powder as well. Ground beef for the Rotel. Ground beef for the ground beef tacos. And then we got some fresh cilantro, lemons, limes, salsa, hot sauce. And then we got the soft shells and chips for the dip. And this is what the ground beef, the shredded chicken, shrimp, and the corn will go in this right here. And then over here, I have pico de gallo. I don't know, y'all. I might just return these. I don't know if you can return groceries. I think, yeah, you can. And may make just some fresh one, but I don't know, girl, whatever. And then we got some sour cream, mini sprites, and Cokes for the girls. So, yeah. That's that real shit.
Again, sometimes it does slow me down. So basically this morning I got up, I vacuumed downstairs, I vacuumed all of upstairs. I changed out the air wicks in the bathrooms and in the house. And I ran out, I got me some Starbucks, I went by Mercedes and looked at a couple cars. Um, the one that I like y'all, the CLA, too little. Like too little the new models look bigger than the older models but as far as the inside it is the same that's why they call it a coupe but i don't know why i was thinking i can get away with that and honestly i just i don't know going from a jeep back to a car i've come to realization that with everything that i be doing y'all like between decorating the house just me and kevin traveling having suitcases we do need an suv so yeah, my mom wants me to look into Range Rovers. Now, don't get me wrong, I used to love Range Rovers, not used to. I still, still, still do love Range Rovers. But here's the thing, I be hearing really bad things about them. So if you got a Range Rover girl, let me know what's your thoughts. Have you had any problems? But I have had, I have heard so many bad things about it. Even on TikTok, when like people be posting the Range Rover, people in the comments be like, girl, wait 50,000 miles, or oh, you finna be spending a lot of money on maintenance, which is any car, especially the luxury, I feel like. I don't know, y'all just let me know, but my mama can't tell me, so she like, we gonna have to do the research together because she's never had a Range Rover. She's a Mercedes girl, so I don't know. I'm very open to it. I always love them. They're so nice. They give me that Jeep look anyway, that boxy look, um, but it got a little curve to it. And I used to love them so much when I used to watch the Kardashian, like keeping up with Kardashian. Girl, I used to love when Chloe got in that black on black Range Rover. Oh, it looked like Batman, Midnight, Pitch Black. So sexy. So yeah, I am open to that. I am gonna go do some looking at those. Not very soon, no rush. Um, I don't I don't know what I'm gonna do. So I'm not even focused on that anymore. There is an update on that and we are done with that. And when I do go look at them, I'll bring you guys along because at the same time, we looking, we may make a move, but we're also manifesting. And it kind of just feels good when you go to these dealerships. That's just something to do, y'all. If y'all not even looking for a car, it feels good going on a lot and just looking at what you can have one day and claiming it and manifesting it and then it actually happening. That's what happened with my Jeep, literally. Like, I want a Jeep, I want a Jeep, I want a Jeep, I want a Jeep. Vision board, praying about it, working hard, saving my money, and it finally happened for me. So I just know whatever is next it will happen regardless just gotta trust the process and be patient and in the meantime figure out what's wrong my car so yeah but other than that i came back home basically did a refresh everything is ready to go i'm about to go downstairs and cook this meat put on the rotel put the chicken in the oven and we should be on track with everything. I also did my hair last night at one o'clock in the morning. I installed this frontal wig. I received this wig so long ago, y'all. I had this wig for two years. Yeah. 
was supposed to do a review on it, but we're not gonna talk about it. But it looks good. Bone straight. I got me a new flat iron. I also didn't even show y'all the stuff that I got from Ulta the other day. I just been kind of like all over the place and forgetting to kind of pick up and check in. So yeah, that's why the check-ins are a little bit long because I'm trying to tell y'all what's going on. Kelly should be here at 4.30. Brittany's on the way. She should be here by five. And yeah, the vibes are gonna get started. So let's go downstairs and continue prepping and get ready for tonight. Oh, oh. Yeah. Sometimes we laugh, sometimes we cry, but I guess you know now. Baby. I took a half and she took the whole thing and slowed down. Baby. We took a trip, now we on your block, and it's like a ghost town. Baby, where did these niggas be at when they say they doing all this and all that? Tired of beefing you bums, you can't even pay me enough to react. Go waking up in the crib, and sometimes I don't even know where I'm at. Everybody's here! My beautiful ladies are here. Cheers to another great night. I love you guys. Thank you for always coming through. We love you. Love you. Now hit it, Brisha. Wow, wow, wow. I ain't lying. Oh, you got it. Oh, you got Silver, silver gonna be the drunkest. Ah, absolutely, absolutely. Hi, absolutely. Right, guys. I'm Chandra, and I know for sure silver is gonna be the drunkest. Yeah. Oh god. Almost there. Hey, it's Kelly and Brooke, and Brittany gonna be the drunkest. Period. Oh lord. Mark my words. <laughs> Hi, my name is Mo, and I think silver is gonna be the drunkest. Oh shit. Where you on? Hey everyone, I'm Risha, and I think Brittany and Silver is gonna be the drunkest. <sighs> Not me. Thank you, Jesus. Hey, Hey, Brittany's gonna be the judge. And it is, and it is. So, Brittany has majority of the votes. Keep your eyes on her tonight, y'all. Yeah! Fell in love with a Cuban. Oh. Isabella, that's a little sister. Okay. Oh, oh. Hello, I'm on the fucking Are you the first victim? <laughs> I know you ain't too sick. For real. Go look at Chandra. Glow, bow, bow. <laughs> she ain't that mute, that guy. Chandra is the drunkest yeah, right now. Show that. Bow, bow, bow. Brooke Kennedy. <laughs> Yeah. 
you get the body. When you got it out, we dress y'all and head out. Cheers, to a great night. Yes, safe night, great night, all day. So we just I'm not taking my camera, y'all, because uh-uh. I'm gonna block my phone. So y'all like cool. First you get that money, then you get that power. If he tune in, knows up, but he on that powder. Now you walk around with 50 in your trousers. Diamonds bullying on my chest, no fucking blouse. Back home, y'all. Get it, Kelly. Ooh, ooh. Three, five, yeah. Hey, babies. Y'all miss me. Even though y'all saw me like a second ago. Or y'all saw us in the club or whatever. In the car. I can't remember what y'all saw. But happy Wednesday, you guys. It's Wednesday, March 20th. And let me just tell you. When I say we had a time on saturday y'all we had such an amazing time which is perfect i feel really good about that y'all know i just love bringing my family and my friends together and it was kind of impromptu but not really impromptu the lemon drops this time y'all i say they were so good i don't know i think it's that Publix lemonade let me show y'all let me show you the lemonade that i used this time Y'all know I like this lemonade anyway. My mom said it's not that good, but I love this lemonade from Publix. I just feel like you can't go wrong with it. And honestly, my lemon drops are pretty simple. I've shown how I've made them before on my channel. I probably will do that with y'all in another vlog or something. But yeah, but y'all, we had a good time. We never checked back in and reported back on who was the drunkest. So I would have to say out of all the girls, me and Kelly. I think me and Kelly was the drunkest. Silver was like drunk when she got here. Like, girl, Silver was on one. My girl was feeling good, but I feel like hers wore off a little bit. Y'all, by the time I got in the club, or you know, at the lounge, whatever you wanna call it, by the time I got there, oh, I was out of it. Like. I knew, like, when I was sitting down, I'm like, yeah, I gotta get up. I gotta dance or something because I just felt all of it coming down on me. So, I didn't even drink like that when we was in there. But, overall, we had a good night. We got back. We was dancing. We was cutting up. Again, I don't even know if I vlogged that. I gotta go back and edit so I can remember. But, them tacos, y'all, busting. I was so happy that everybody loved them. They were like, it was so good. So, yeah, I can't wait to throw another one. I think I want to do, like, maybe... A cookout or something some type of other theme i don't know and we'll probably have the fellas here as well i was thinking about doing something fun outside like we play kickball or something i don't know girl but we're gonna do something lit something lit something lit but i got a lot of stuff coming up y'all i can't believe it's almost april we got some trips coming up it's just so much stuff i got so much stuff and i just need to get back on my zoom and get back to pushing out content content and just really be on a strict schedule i'm starting back in the gym i'm going to pilates you guys today i'm going to pilates for the first time then i hit my girl sheena up and i'm like sheena you want to go to pilates with me so we're going to pilates today at seven y'all and i'm going to try to vlog i heard you can't vlog in those studios so i'm gonna try to see what i can do and try to sneak it but yeah i'm trying to get this body tight and we all know the girls that be up in pilates be looking good <laughs> I'm about to make me some lunch. I'm gonna make these um kind of like chicken quesadilla style tacos because I got some leftover meat. Make that, eat me some lunch, get back to work, and then I'm gonna pick the camera back up later tonight or this evening when I'm headed to Pilates. So yeah. You a bad girl and your friends bad too. Oh, you got the swag sauce, you drip the swag goo. You a bad girl and your friends bad too. Oh, you got the swag sauce, you drip the swag goo. Hey, Brookie baby. Yeah, I'd be laughing. You want to say hey? <laughs> I don't know why I decided to do this with Sheena. No, no, no. 
No, no, no. You were invited. <laughs> I don't know why I decided to do it with her. <laughs> flip my ass out one of these damn things. <laughs> Yo. No, because she almost flipped me out of this car. Yo, what you did? I almost, next time I'm driving. <laughs> Cause I wanted to be past the princess today. She wanted uh -huh. to be past the princess. She won't be princess no goddamn more. <laughs> no, 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 I won't. <laughs> Come on. Look at you all discombobulated. Yeah, cause I'm, I'm, my nerves bad. <laughs> <laughs> you missed the toe. <laughs> yeah. We gonna be serious in class, y'all. We promise. <laughs> you see who was a class clown in high school? You. <laughs> she know. Oh, wow. I can't get. <laughs> you gonna feel good about it. Here we go, y'all. <laughs> hey, babe. So it's a couple days later. It's actually Sunday, and I'm just hopping on real quick to close out today's video. Let me just give y'all an update on Pilates. When I say your girl is pending being a Pilates girl, basically what I got to do is go up there or call and talk on the phone and learn some more information about their packages and stuff because y'all, I absolutely loved it, okay? Y'all know I love working out. Whenever I'm in the zone, on my Zoom, and consistent, like, regardless if I go to the gym for a month, stop, go to the gym for two months, stop, go to the gym for six months, go to the gym for a freaking day. Anytime I step foot in the gym, I take it serious. That's one thing I can't say about me. Like, I actually do know how to work out. You get what I'm saying? Like, I can go to the gym by myself. I know what I need to do. I may not know the name of every workout, but I know what works for my body. And I'm not just in there kind of like shy. And, oh, uh, people are looking at me. Or just trying to hide on like a treadmill. Girl, past those days. Like, that was in my beginning, beginning time of starting to work out. But now... Girl, I be going up in there trying to size up the men like, what's up? Because my husband taught me how to do all this, so what's up? What are you talking about? Me? Oh, okay. Him back there? Okay, good, good, good. <laughs> but yeah, that's how I be. So. so I say all that to say, we had a lot of fun. We were laughing a lot, but I took it serious and I could feel every muscle. It felt like every muscle in my body was being worked. And I was so sore. It's finally gone now because it's Sunday, but I was so sore on Thursday and Friday, a little bit yesterday, and I'm finally just feeling a little bit better. So I'm gonna keep y'all updated on that. Probably will be making that call this week. And yeah, that's pretty much it, y'all. That's all the updates that I had. I never showed y'all what I got from Ulta. I just picked up some makeup brushes and I did get a new perfume. I think it's gonna be perfect for the um, spring and like summertime. So let me show y'all that real quick. Okay, y'all, so it's the Gucci Flora Gorgeous Gardenia. This right here smells so good. Girl, it smells so, so good. So definitely get your hands on this. If you're a fruity floral type of girl, you're gonna love this. I don't really like, I don't go for this. I told y'all that in the vlog. I'm not gonna go for this first. But I do like to have a different variety of different smells and fragrances. This is definitely something I'll put on like when I'm out the shower or I'm relaxing in the house or I'm doing like a girls night or I just want to be like sweet and sexy on a date night. I don't know. But I like this. I like this a lot. So I'll link it below in case you guys are interested. And yeah, y'all, that's it. Today is very chill. It's 12 o'clock, but it feels like... I went through a whole day, which I love because I have the rest of today to do basically whatever I want. I woke up this morning at 8, had breakfast, laid back down for a little bit, put in a Publix grocery order because I needed a few things. I know I said that I wasn't going to keep shopping at Publix like that, but it needed convenience for me. I put that order in at 10 o'clock and it said select between 1 and 2 for pickup. My order was ready at like 10.45. Walmart told me I had to wait until 3. I'm doing a crock pot meal today so I can enjoy the rest of my day and just relax and catch up on some rest because yesterday I did a whole bunch of cleaning. So yeah, I'm like, nah, I need something easy. So yeah, that's it. I'm gonna go edit and add in this last clip, try to get this video uploaded for you guys today. Again, I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, please make sure to give your girl a thumbs up. Leave me a comment, share the video, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Join the Bricky Baby gang, because the Bricky Babies are lit. We have fun, and if you subscribe, you're going to have some fun too. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you in my next one, Bricky Baby.
Y'all ready? Broken baby. Peace. I love you guys.